Today is Friday, November 2nd, 2012, time 4.44 a.m. This video is on Hurricane Sandy. Yesterday I came across several photographs which was uploaded in Yahoo News. And I found several photographs that more or less gave me flashback to a dream I had in 2010. I dreamt that I saw the New York City skyline and that it was dark and I picked up something terrible might have happened inside this dream. The water was black, the uh, skyline um, behind the skyline was very dark and I mentioned in this dream something about Battery Park. I picked up that the skyline that I was looking at inside this dream I had in 2010 was maybe the skyline of Battery Park. Anyhow, so we know that Hurricane Sandy came here in New York and in other places in the East Coast. And so, like I said, yesterday I was on Yahoo News and here's a photograph of water that came in the Battery Park. And it says here, Water reaches the street level of the Battery Park underpass. Tuesday, October 30th, 2012 in New York. Sandy arrived along the East Coast and morphed it into a huge and problematic system. Putting more than 7.5 million homes and businesses in the dock and causing a number of deaths. So I said, wow, I recall having a dream and I recall saying something about Battery Park. So I continue to go and look at some photographs and I came across a photograph someone have taken of the New York City skyline, which I will show you guys. Okay, so this is the first photograph I came upon that shows New York City skyline. This video was taken on Monday, October 29, 2012, the skyline of New York City. So I said, wow, okay, looks quite similar to the dream I had in 2010. Then I come across another photograph of the New York City skyline. Now, this particular skyline of New York City really gave me a flashback to a dream drawing I made about the... Skyline New York City I saw in 2010. So I said, well, let me go on and look for the drawing that uh, showed me this skyline that I dreamt about. But I said, but first, let me continue looking at some of these photographs. And I came across this particular photograph, which shows a better, I guess, view of the skyline. It shows more detail. It shows gray skies over New York City. It shows dark waters. This is, say here, a general view from Exchange Place shows the skyline of lower Manhattan in darkness after a preventive power outage caused by giant storm Sandy in New York, October 30th, 2012. Millions of people in etc etc and etc so I said wait a second I believe I have posted the dream I had in 2010 in one of my YouTube channels and of course I go into the YouTube channels that I have and I came upon this and this video the dream I had in 2010 I uploaded this video on April 26 2011 and the title I've given this film is called Parish's Future Prophecies, Part 4, Section 8, 3 of 6, Letters A through Y, 2010. Now, here in this video, you will hear me mentioning something about the Battery Parkway. So, let me just play this video. 
So I had this dream in 2009, not in 2010. Been a long time since I ever thought about this dream. Let me continue. Within a few seconds, I fall asleep. Then suddenly my eyes pop open for some unknown reasons. And now I was awakened from my sleep. Then I attempt to get up from my bed, but I quickly realized I could not move. The only part of my body I could move were my eyes. My room was still semi-dark, just the way it was when I lay down for a nap. Then my eyes began to detect several things moving around inside my room. These things that moved inside my room began to form into whiffs of smoke. And then the whiffs of smoke became spiritual beings. These spiritual beings were now flying over my head and over my feet. I could not believe what was happening around me. The spirits I seen did not fight me. I just lay there upon my bed, taking in everything that was going on inside my room. I think I was I think I was not really asleep or really awake. I believe I have been stuck somewhere in time. These spirits in my room showed no sign to me that they wanted to hurt me. I sensed these spirit beings were only trying to get my attention. Then I spotted a scroll materialized over my feet. Then the scroll was rolled out from left to right. The scroll was now fully rolled out. Then I seen what was in the center of the scroll. Then I quickly figured out what I was looking at. I was actually looking at the silhouette of New York City. The silhouette of New York City was bathed in a bluish light. Now I became afraid, and then I said out loud, Oh my God, look what happened to New York City. That's New York City. Oh my God, look at New York City. Look what happened to New York City. Then after I gazed upon the bluish silhouette of New York City, I then called upon my guardian angels to come and release me from my paralyzed state. Within seconds, I could move my hands and legs down. Then I slowly risen myself up into a sitting position. Then I sat up in my bed and I looked across my room. Then I spotted my clock. I believe my clock read 7.49 p.m. I continued to sit upon my bed for a minute or two so that I could collect my thoughts and to also calm myself down. After I calmed down, I then climbed out of my bed so that I could record this bizarre dream inside my dream book. And here we go again. Um, me showing where I um, dreamt about in a drawing form. As I stated, I see a scroll rolled out in front of me, and in the center of the scroll, I see the silhouette of New York, and that New York was bathed in a bluish light, you know, like a bluish light one would see when one turns on a stove and a bluish gassy flames appear.
Okay, so here's a photo again um, of the Manhattan skyline. You see dark clouds in the background, dark waters, and um, the tall structure that I drawn, which was in the center. The center oh, was in the center, and it was small, small buildings around it. Okay, so here's a drawing. So I believe this is one world trade tower that they are still working on so here's the drawing that I made in 2009 and here's the Madden skyline so I believe this is this okay and like I said in this film I mean in this video I said I picked up something about Battery Park and here's is this okay so let me show you the original drawing that I made I found it so I want to show you the original drawing that I made about this drink okay so here is the original drawing okay here's the original drawing let me Turn on computer again. Okay, here's the original drawing. So I just want to kind of compare it. Okay, so let me pull this back a bit. Alright, so this is the drawing that I made of New York City skyline. guys and gals have to realize that when I see things like this in my dreams I use a scene like very quickly like a real hot second and I usually wake up from my dream and I sit up on the bed and meditate on the dream I just experienced and it takes for me it takes a while for me to remember everything and the things which was shown to me in, I guess, a dream. I have to remember the details the best of my abilities. And this is more or less was the best of my abilities. So this is what I saw in my dream again. And this looks eerily similar to this. So basically what I'm trying to say is that I believe I had a premonition of what's going to happen to New York. This premonition was given to me in 2009 and it finally came to pass in 2011. So I think what I was shown was an aftermath of a powerful superstorm that slapped New York City around. And the rest of the East Coast. Okay, guys and gals, thank you for watching my video and have a fantastic day. Take care.